Hello, my name is Grian, and today I was challenged, well, the other day I was challenged to play one full hour of build battle. I'm obviously going to get as close as I can to an hour, and I accept the challenge. So, let's get into it. Straight away. Let's see what the first round brings. Hopefully, well, I want to try and win as many as possible, but it's not a big deal if I don't. We'll just see how each game and what takes us there. So, theme is Pikachu. Fortunately, I know what Pikachu is. I basically grew up with Pikachu in my life. I was born at the time where Pokemon was in its very early days, and I was like one of those kids that just absolutely adored it. So, this is going to be kind of... I know, I know what Pikachu looks like, pretty much down to a T. So we can, uh, whether I can actually, whether I can, uh, put it in Minecraft or not is another story. Having said that, now that I, now that I think about it, I need to not, like, not big myself up too much because I'm not sure that I can actually produce the Pikachu that everyone, that I'm bigging myself up to be able to. So... I'm sort of going on a very early version of Pikachu. I remember him, you know, from, like, uh, the first movie. He was kind of round. He's, he looks a lot cooler than he did back in the day. He was, like, this round, mousy, like, yellow blob. Now he's, like, this cool, slim... He's, like, he, like, lost a few pounds. He's, <laughs> he's looking pretty good. So I'm kind of going to try and give him the little uh, belly that he should have. I suppose is the the way to phrase it. Does he have anything on his front? I don't think so. I'm going completely by... Oh my god, this is terrible. This is gonna end up absolutely terrible. Uh, <laughs> I think it's because of this. I'm gonna have to, like, knock out some of that. Add this, maybe, and remove this. And actually, that, that just improved it a little bit. So... Let's uh, try and give him a rounded back. I'm not too worried about the back because most people in build battle go to the front to look at the build. So now I am going to just do my best to replicate a Pikachu body. And he has a very distinct tail, if I remember correctly. So it like goes in zigzag fashion. And that's as far as I can go. So I'm gonna have to deal with that best I can. Uh, that's kind of not what I wanted from that. Uh, it can, can do that. Right, so he has lines like that. He also has lines on his back. So this should work out pretty well. I hope, having said that, people go to the front. I hope they do look at the back now because I have put the extra detail in with the lines. Now, it's actually very hard, without a reference picture to hand, to sort of remember what Pikachu's very distinct dimensions are to the T. So I'm kind of going to have to make a awful looking head, but make sure that I get the distinct ears done. I've only got, got two minutes left, that should be plenty of time. Not in too much of a rush. I'm not expecting to win this one, because my Pikachu's not, not the greatest thing in the world. So... It's not, not the end of the world. Uh, but having said that, I will still try my best. And get the ears right. Uh, how many is three? Then three again. Like so. With a... Because he has those like little bits there. He does have arms. He does have arms. So I'm going to have to try and get some arms in there like they are only diddy and getting a neck right in minecraft is actually pretty difficult uh so <laughs> i'm having a i'm having a tough time here <laughs> i know what pikachu looks like don't get me wrong this is not this is not what i remember pikachu to look like <laughs> i um do, does he have anything at the front oh, i tell you what is not helping is that i've made these legs like a bit too out of scale and I need to like knock in the sides a bit because he he's not that chub chub. Although now his legs are a bit far out. Uh, can just sort of build up the legs a bit. That actually that actually kind of helped the build a bit. So if I knock out this again, get the thickness right, and perhaps just perhaps 
Oh, there's only 30 seconds. Oh, I should probably give him some eyes. He definitely has, like, big, big black eyes, doesn't he? Oh, bugger. I need a black stained clay. There we go. Um, does he, he just has, a, like, a normal black mouth, doesn't he? So, it can probably, like... Um... <laughs> oh, <laughs> that is so much better than mine. Uh, I'm gonna have to give that really good. That's so much. That's that's literally pretty good. I guess people have really uh, been playing this. Uh, that's also probably better than mine. Uh, I'm gonna have to give that good as well. I probably should have given that one before epic, but this one's definitely good. <laughs> I just overcome like I just mine is so bad. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. Uh, it's not really Pikachu, but it's cute. Does he have a red nose? He doesn't have a red nose, does he? <laughs> I can't. I can't look at it. I can't look at it too much. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, he has the red cheeks. I'm such an idiot. That's like one of the distinct things. That's very good as pixel art, but this is a. Oh, but I'm such a fool. This one does not deserve anything like. What? That's not Pikachu. Uh, I just don't. I don't understand some people in this game. <sighs> okay. Oh, I actually really. I really like that. It's, they've got the full thing. I'm gonna go epic. Although, there's like. Just a small problem with his arm coming out of his mouth there but it's really cool and the Pikachu here is I guess I'm coming around this side they, they tried I'm gonna go okay it actually resembles a Pikachu which cannot be said for some of the other ones and uh, we'll see what this see this is what I should have done this is this is what I should have done I'm gonna go epic because they've they've actually done a really good job although I'm not sure why they chose to have it oh lightning oh, I see oh wow that's really clever that's really clever. I'm really ashamed of my Pikachu. <laughs> That's actually also good. Not quite as good as the other one. I should have given that other one a legendary, to be honest. I hope they win. I really hope they win. And let's see. Um, this one's pretty good. This one's pretty good. They got some of the stuff down. Yeah, I'm going to give it good. Again, I'm not a fan of pixel art for winning the round. Oh, wow. Really? I came like last and I deserved it. <laughs> well, I came like next to last. This guy, although did really well, I actually think the guy with the lightning deserved to win. Okay, so let's let's hop straight into another one. <laughs> oh wow, that's embarrassing. So we're off to a great start. Uh, the first one was not good. So we are zero out of one. And the theme is candle. Okay, okay. I'm, I can come up with something, I think. Uh, maybe. Let's have a, let's have a quick think. So, what colour is a candle? That, but I'm needing a wick for the top. So I'm going to take some fence block. I'm not too good at doing the whole fire thing, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, so, right. Let's have a think how I'm going to do this, because every time... I consider <laughs> how how it looks in my mind's eye. It never ends up looking that way in real life. And already, I'm not off to a good start. So let's try that again. I'm going to go up in the air. I'm going to make a quick circle. Just a th just a three three uh, three sided one. Very simple. And. I'm now going to quickly add a base as well. Uh, trying to think out loud here. Right, so I'm also going to add a little bit down there. I'm thinking of like an old fashioned candle before electricity, you know, like you'd light a candle and carry it around like a night lamp. So that's that's what I'm hoping for here. What have I, what have I done? What, what mess have I created here? Oh, I haven't done that. Right, okay, so, I'm going to quickly 
finish the base. I have already wasted two minutes of this round. And I'm now going to do the little candle thing. Uh, get rid of that. And hopefully I will actually have time to do the candle itself. And we're there, but I feel like I've messed up somewhere. I've messed up multiple times going around this. I think it's supposed to look like that. How have I... Wow, I've really messed up. Oh boy. Oh man, this is gonna... This is wasting a whole bunch of my time. Um, round the clock, round the clock, round the clock. Okay, there, oh, I fixed it. I think. Yeah. Okay, that's fixed. Right, so, now, I'm going to create a quick lip using cobblestone stairs. Really simple. And then I'm going to create a quick handle. I hope people really under- I hope, like, the people know what I've built here, for one, because Obviously, if they've never seen a candle like this, they're gonna wonder, like, what the hell have I made? Okay, um, I'm actually gonna raise this up. I still think there's time. The candle itself is gonna take next to no time at all. And... Yep, that'll do. Now, straight up for the candle, with a wick on the top. And... Now I can sort of just create up a candle here, like a, a long, long candle, and like steadily, steadily make it go up to each one. Now the, the key here is that I've made each one of these round the side a different length so that it has more shape when you get there. So, and you can see like the further away I get from the middle, the shallower I'm going with the height. So that's kind of just a quick little thing to take note of if you ever find yourself in the situation. I might be able to do some fire animation. In fact, I'm not too happy with how high this is. So I'm gonna knock those down a bit. It's okay to have some of them the same height, but if they're like very comparable like that is, might be best to just knock some of them down or up depending on what you are what you want so I'm actually gonna get rid of these I feel like it's not necessary there we go actually I kind of like that and we could even add some wax down the bottom here it's like like it's dripping I'm not gonna bother with the fire although I could see if flint and steel will work on of that oh oh i'm a genius look at that i'm a genius okay i kind of i'm kind of proud of that and it was like so calmly finished on time come on round two right um i'm gonna have to poop this i'm really sorry i just it's not a candle that's not a candle at all those are three villagers and a bunch of diorite or whatever the hell it's called I guess, oh wait, no, 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 yeah, that's actually pretty good. I get that it's like, it's like a candlelit dinner, although those candles look like they'd set the house on fire. <laughs> um, um, not sure. Um, if I understood what it was, I'd probably give it okay, but I just, holy moly, this guy's had an explosion. Okay, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna ignore this mess, and I'm gonna take this over here, I'm gonna give it okay, because at least this looks kind of like a candle. <laughs> um, what? Is that, is he holding a candle? I, I'm gonna go for okay, because he's built a table and a duck, which is great. But the candle bit, not so much. Let's see what people think of mine. There's a fire there? Yeah, the fire's there. <laughs> hey. So, oh, let's see what people think. Uh, um oh okay that's that's good i really like that it's good i'm not sure what this is like must be the uh wax and then these are like really tall candles and stuff so i like that one um i'm i think people really haven't grasped what a candle is i'm not sure what that is 
Is it? Okay. Oi, we win! Yeah, okay, so cool. That's one game out of two. And we're in like 15 minutes into the hour of build battle. Hey, that's really... I'm happy with that. I personally, I think that mine was the best out of there. And I am honest when I think that someone else should win. So let's hop straight into the next game. One thing that I want to point out when playing build battle is when people make a human, like a cute little human, just to make their build look better. Oh, B. Oh, that's that's cute. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna take that. This I feel like people will be really good at this. All right. Um, I actually want some custom skulls for this. So I want some color. Uh, I want some big black eyes. Oh, I didn't really need to get two. Uh, that will do. And I'm gonna want some nether fence. So yeah, as I was saying, uh, I don't think that build battle people like when you make a really quick. For example, there, when it, the theme was candle, right? But that guy made a cute duck holding a uh, torch. Although the theme, uh, like, although that's great and everything, the theme was candle, man. Like, you can't, it's almost like you're just trying to detract from the fact that you can't build a candle, you know? <laughs> so, with this bee, um, sorry to go off on tangents all the time, but with this bee, I need to make sure that like, although it's going to have stripes, it's not completely perfect. And I think that's rather important in a build like this. So you can have overlapping layers of the black and white. And I'm going to make my way down, trying to keep it as cute as possible. Because bees are, are very cute. So going to... Uh, try and bring it in now just with a small layer and let's see that's probably not the best there how do I how am I gonna do this how am I gonna do this to make it look cuter I guess the wings will make it look cuter but for now that might have to do <laughs> Um, right, so the wings. The wings are important. I'm just going to use white stained glass to sort of mimic how thin they are going to be. And of course, bees are insects, so they have six legs. So I'm just going to place them. And one more. There we go. So that's kind of cute. I'm kind of I'm kind of happy, but I just I know on a on a theme like this. Everyone's gonna have really cool builds and because I've I've never made a bee before I'm just sort of going on what I possibly know uh, Theirs is probably going to be better than mine They probably got like a really good idea of what a bee should be <laughs> I, 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 I think mine's cute. I'm gonna call him Billy uh, I got two minutes left, so there's no need to rush on this. I can in fact like add some little details um, I don't, I actually need to make these as symmetrical as possible, which is annoying because it's glass panes and I just spammed them everywhere, but as close to as I can get, the better. And I'm going to keep trying to do that. Uh, let's see, let's take a step back. Need a couple more blocks here on the side, one up the top. And that's not too shabby actually. Uh, the whole thing is off center, but one block you can see here. I can actually fix that probably by adding that block there. How could I improve this build? Not too sure right now. Um, bees are quite cute. I'm gonna actually just edit the top here to try and make make it a bit more cute. And I'm actually going to add some gray in here to try and give it some texture. I've got a minute so I'm still not too worried. I'm kind of finished so if all else fails I still have a B to show everybody. Let's take a step back again. It's important to always take a step back. I could build... okay I'm gonna rush it. I'm going to rush a quick flower for the B because I feel like it goes well with the B theme. 
and it shouldn't take me too long if I'm just being very quick. So I had 45 seconds to build this, and now I have very little time. Let's take a quick look and make a flower. 18 seconds, no worries at all. And this is the worst flower. This was probably a waste of time. Let's actually make it a tulip since I don't have time to get another block out. No! Oh, that'll have to do. That'll have to do. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like a dancing bee? That's pretty good. Uh, I have to give it to him. <gasps> oh, wait! Oh, wait, 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 wait. That looks like the... from the movie, I think. That's good. I like this. This is... this is pretty cool. It's gold. He went for iron fence, which... Pretty sure it would weigh the bee down, but that's still cute nonetheless. I'm gonna give it a good. And wait, let me just try and get some perspective on this. Okay, I'm going to take this as his bee, uh, because I'm not sure what that is, and I'm going to give it a good. Uh, let's take a look. This guy, oh, he did finish. Almost, almost finished. I have to penalize him for not finishing, but that is quite good, but. I think the others are better. I think pixel art is, you know, not the best thing. Okay, so here's my B. <laughs> oh dear. Organics are not my thing. We'll have to. We'll have to see. Uh, um, that's actually uh, so cute. That's really cute. I'm gonna give that good. That's actually really cute. I've got nothing else to say. It's like small, dainty. And to the point, is has this guy got a front? I think this is the... I'm going to have to only give it okay. They built a B, but, like, there's no wings and stuff. Okay. Um, again, I'm going to have to give it okay. I like the concept, and he could have gone it cuter, but, I mean, it hasn't got any wings. It hasn't got any legs and all that kind of stuff. Oh, these are that's a nice design. I like this. It's it's square but streamlined and he's got stinger. I didn't even add a stinger. That was kind of dumb of me. So I'm going to give him okay. Oh, well, I should have given him good. Whoops. Sorry, Mr. Man. Um it's snowing here and the bees are out. That doesn't quite compute. Although it is quite it's, Oh, it's got I I like what they've done with the eyes, so I have to give that one good for the creative eyes. Let's take a look. Um, I'm only going to give this okay. They've built a B. Actually, I'm going to give it a good because I have to stay consistent as possible. Hey, this... Oh, wow. I really like... That's epic. I really like that. That's really cute. They've done pretty much exactly the same as me, but they've managed to, like, make the B cuter. <laughs> and looking at that, that looks more like a hoverfly, if you know what they are. We have them over here in the UK, but uh, I'm going to have to give that a good for the sake of consistency. They've done quite a good job of giving a B. Hey, I won! Wow, I won by like a landslide. That's a huge amount. Wow. I really don't think that I deserve to win. Maybe. I think that that person that did uh, the cuteness, uh, the cute B, probably deserved to win that round. So, that was round three, so we're now on to number four, so we've got two out of three. Whew, this is exhausting. we still got a bunch more rounds to go. So let's see what comes up next. Thankfully, I haven't had any repeat themes, so let's have a quick mosey at what it is. Volcano. Oh, I wish, I wish I had a uh, voxel sniper right now. That's not oh, it's not okay. Like, I could make a sick volcano in no seconds flat. Like, nothing. You, I'd just imagine it'd be there. But, unfortunately, <laughs> I am stuck with having to hand place them. So, this is going to be tough. So, I'm going to start off by spamming. Uh, I'm going to lay out a general circle where I want the volcano to be. Now I'm going to have a bunch of surrounding uh, rocks and stuff. Now, getting this right is it's not going to look great because I, just, I don't have time to texture it in the way I'd hope. Now, and this is also, unfortunately for you viewing the video, it's going to be rather boring because I'm going to be working my way around by hand 
placing up these to create a volcano. So, <laughs> it's going to be a rather lengthy just spam of uh, this clay block because I'm going for a uh, grey volcano. People really like coloured clay in build battle and I'm going to use that to play to my strengths of knowing how to get an organic shape. So I just need to keep working my way around and hopefully I won't hit the ceiling because there is a build limit on this. And I need to make sure that it <laughs> doesn't take me, I mean I've wasted two minutes already, two minutes. And I need to keep going, keep going, and it will... I need to also make sure that the closer I get, the more intense it goes up. So right now it needs to just be kind of steady, and I am achieving that very slowly. Um, <laughs> but it's it's not, not, not the greatest thing right now, and I really need a minute spare in order to detail it. Uh, I also need to start using some other blocks to give it the texture, because I don't, obviously don't have Voxel Sniper to texture very quickly, so I have to do that by hand. There's probably going to be holes everywhere, and I'm probably getting to the point where I can start going ham on going upwards. Oh boy, and <clears throat> let's take a quick gander. Let's take a step back. It's not, not the best. I'm going to admit it. I'm going to admit it. It's not the best. Now I need to go up really high, using uh, going steeper, because obviously volcanoes peak really hard towards the middle, and I need to make sure that I get that the best I can as well. Although, well, five minutes is not enough time to do that effectively. And two minutes remaining, and I need enough time to have like lava spewing out uh, and stuff like that, so... Now I can take this block and attempt to have a ring around the top, which is a different block, but I've kind of messed up here by spamming so much and rather haphazardly without thinking about it. I have created quite a mess of uh, things here, so <laughs> that's not, not the best for me. Uh, I should probably change the floor because it doesn't actually look very good. So I'm actually going to change that to, I'm going to change that to grass. Um, wasting a lot of time. Change that to grass. Right, cool. And I'm going to have lava come down the sides, if it would flow correctly. Just need to make sure that I have the correct, there you go. And then yeah, you can go down. Right, now you can have that aim for it. Manipulating any sort of liquid in Minecraft is quite horrible. So now I need to grab some red and some orange and spam. I didn't even grab the orange, I think I threw it on the floor. Great, another, another few seconds wasted and time is precious in this game. Um, so I'm gonna like make it look like it's exploding the best I can. And obviously it doesn't look too good right now, but what I'm going to do once I've placed all these is... Actually, you need to get the yellow as well, quick. Why does the yellow have to be at the bottom? And I'm going to delete some of these blocks to make it less thick and to make it look like it's actually exploding. And have some lava in the top. That's the best I can do. <laughs> that was the best I can do. And it was a bit better than this guy, who is going to get an okay, because they've, I suppose technically, it counts as a volcano, and I only give people super poop and poop when it does not resemble the theme at all. So this guy again is going to get an okay. It, actually, I'm gonna give it good, I don't, I'll have to hold withhold judgement to see what everyone else has done. Okay, this one definitely deserved good. It definitely deserves good, and I can completely relate with everyone that has tried to make a volcano because it's not been easy. You saw how much time I had left, it was like nothing. And again, I'm gonna give this good, it's not too bad. And it's just so difficult to get all of those blocks placed in the five minute time. And this guy's got some effects, it's square i probably would have given them epic if they had gone for a little bit more smooth edge instead of doing like a pyramid because it looks less like a volcano more like a bedrock pyramid 
I actually kind of like this one, but it is, again, only deserving of a good, I think. But again, these people have done well. I completely sympathize with people's work here, and I do not agree with the use of the gold and diamond ore, so you're going to score only an okay, because I think you probably could have chosen some better blocks, although I do appreciate the dead bushes around. Let's take a look at this one. That one is gonna only have to qualify as an okay because some of the other volcanoes were better. I do like, yeah, people have done well this one. And then there's mine. Oh no, there's a hole in it. A hole in my volcano. So yeah, I tried. It doesn't, now that I like take a step back and have a look, it's not, not too good. I could have textured it a bit better, that's for sure. Um, <laughs> and let's have a look at this. Again, okay, it qualifies as a volcano. Don't perhaps agree with the random lava plays. Hey, not bad. Nice one. I I do agree that it was a difficult round for everyone, including me. I struggled with that. Definitely, definitely struggled with that. And now we're on to number five. Number five it is. Who? This has been this has been really intense. I must admit. So I've got another probably four rounds to go before I can complete my hour of build battle. This is going to be interesting. Let's see what the next one is. So I think I've won three out of four, in fact. So that's not too bad. Popcorn. So immediately in my mind, the stereotypical American bag of yellow and red pops into my mind. But what can I use as popcorn? Probably the sandstone block pop, uh, comes to mind. Or even sponge. Sponge might do well here. So let's not dawdle too much. Let's get a bag going. So um, perhaps something like this would do nicely. So instead of that... Uh, Something kind of simple. Simplicity in build battle is actually highly appreciated. When you try and go a bit too hard on your build, it sometimes doesn't come out as well as you'd hoped because you either don't have enough time, you're rushing, you're panicking, or you just can't quite get what you were after. And that's completely understandable. I feel exactly the same way when I'm rushing, like you saw the Pikachu at the start, I thought I had that down in my head, but <laughs> when it came to it, it just didn't translate well at all, but it ended up being pretty funny. So that's a really good thing. Let's take a quick gander at this and we are back up. So there we go, that's my popcorn thing. So. I think I'm going to go for sponge. This perhaps is not my best work. I feel like people are going to do better than me on this one. Uh, but maybe if I produce... Uh, I don't... I, I don't think I even have any excuse here. <laughs> I don't think I have any excuse. Uh, I'm going to just try and produce the best damn popcorn you've ever seen. Uh... I actually think I need to change this block to be that. Perhaps. Uh, no, 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 no. That's probably a bad mistake. And it's too late to change my build. Uh, does it have like a? Th I think I could probably go for like a thick ring of red around the bottom just to highlight it and make it look like it doesn't just extend into the floor. Um, I got to admit that's pretty poor on my part not not too sure <laughs> not too sure on that one perhaps I could have gone bigger taller more popcorn um, popcorns and a difficult one I guess I could now quickly make a bowl full of popcorn but I don't have that much time but since I do have two minutes it's probably worth trying to increase my score as much as possible so let's try let's try I need to to make just the standard bowl that I've made before 
um, because obviously you need enough space to place just blocks, so the scale of it needs to be quite big. I mean, it's only small popcorn at the end of the day, and but each popcorn is like one sponge block, so I gotta spam the hell out of them. Perhaps sandstone is a better sandstone is definitely a better choice. I feel maybe if I have time, I'll go back and change the other one. But right now, I'm messing up a lot, and sandstone was definitely should have been my first choice. That is for sure. And I think I might have time to go and swap over to sandstone on this. In fact, I might if I'm quick be able to just overlay on the top get rid of that yep. oh ooh, 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 ooh. 40 seconds actually I've got plenty of time I don't have to brush too hard 40 seconds is enough to place um, some sandstone I'm making sure that I get these very important gaps in between them I think sandstone looks a lot more like popcorn for a start and I think it was the sponge that was making my build look really bad. And a few more perhaps in the middle here. And one in the air. And another one here. And that's probably enough for me. There we go. Let's see how that does. That's not particularly good. Oh, someone used glowstone. That's clever. That's good. They went for the similar thing as me. They made a pot. It's not circular, but it's pretty good. So I'm going to go good on that one. GG. Someone said it. So the theme is popcorn and not corn, but they have done something different. So I'm going to have to give it okay, but it is popcorn and not, you know, corn itself. I really like that. Butter... <laughs> Butter pops. I'm gonna have to say good on that one because they did the same same as the first one. They actually used a better choice than me. You notice how I used the red and yellow. Hey, look, it's me. Yeah. So um, let's see if people like this. It's a bowl of popcorn, and uh, I think everyone has done the same thing. They've gone for a bag of popcorn. And the next one, G pop. <laughs> okay, so they just wrote the word pop. I'm gonna have to go. Okay, they have put some popcorn into a rather oddly shaped bowl but it's just not as good as some of the other people's now that's clever i like this i like this they put some thought into that and they've even had a drink i'm gonna have to go for good because they've done something different yeah it's but it, it's not as innovative as it could be and i do withhold epic and legendary for something that i would be like whoa i'm that's just popcorn on the floor so i'm gonna have to go okay and this one again, I'm going to have to, for the sake of consistency, give it good. And if I was rating my own, I would probably give myself good as well, just as I've been giving everyone that's done the same idea of this as this. So let's take a quick look at this. This is very simple. It's not quite as good as the other ones, although they've used the same idea as us. And I say us because a lot of us have done it. And I've said this before, and I'm not sure if I've said it in, during this video. People that make, like, little uh, people to improve their builds is not good. Like, I have to take a look at the popcorn, and I should have probably given it good instead of okay, which was my bad. They've put popcorn everywhere. I actually really like this one. It's going to have to go up in the good. Uh, so, yeah, as I was saying, like, people just, there you go, see that this guy won. I came fourth, which is understandable because mine was not the best. So, we are three out of five for build out. But see, this annoys me. This person should have nothing to do with the build because it, the theme is popcorn. You have to build popcorn. You, people, like, build tellies and then uh, have someone watching the telly. It's, um... I think it's just a sort of a cheap way of trying to improve your build, like by decorating it with a very easy to make human being. So, right, let's have a, another round. We are. This is rather exhausting, actually. Laptop. Right. I've actually built one of these before in my time, so I'm going to get a uh, head, colored head, gray, and probably going to want a trackpad so i'm going to resort to my old gray cyan block and i'm also going to want a black do i want yeah i want black um so 
is going to be a very simple build. So people appreciate the, the simple things. So I'm going to make this cornered off, like so. And work my way round. And that's probably enough for the laptop itself. So let's make our way filling this in. This is where the keyboard is going to go, and I'm also going to do a trackpad because that's a very defining feature of a laptop, and I don't really want people to get confused with a computer in this build. So I'm going to continue to spam the grey block because, well, for the most part, I don't know how it is with you guys with your laptops, but my one is mainly grey. And I've seen plenty of like grey silver ones, so just for the sake of trying to get people to know what my build is, I'm going to just stick with the grey block, although it might feel like I've used grey quite a lot in this video. In these rounds of build battle anyway. So let's make a screen there, that's probably big enough to look like it falls down. Now I've gone for the angle because everyone has their laptop open at an angle. Or most people anyway, you don't have it completely flat. And I think that's what's going to make my build stand out from the rest. The fact that most people will have like this shape, just the L shape like that. So uh, I probably want to actually take a different colored head because I that's gray, so I want light gray. I need some contrast. So there's the escape key. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Now Oh, 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 I don't want the angled, so let's just have a bunch of keys. So, like, I need to, I made it look like, you know, F1, escape, it's not perfect, obviously, but it's going to do, and I have no idea how I can simulate, actually, yes, I do, yes, I do. I, uh, I had a stroke of genius, and there's the space bar, and that will have to do, oh, that's going to trigger a lot of people. Okay. Cool, they're all in line. Now I need to do the trackpad, which is usually here. Uh, is there a lighter stain? This is going to have to do for now. It's not the best, but uh, there we are. I need to grab the black that I just got rid of rather stupidly and make my way down with the remaining two minutes that I have, which is not the best, not the best. So, need to try and do this. Now, I must admit, when you are confronted with a build battle theme that you have not done before, you are at a very distinct disadvantage to everyone else that has played this game for a long time and are familiar with all of the themes because not only have they seen what works with build battle, what people vote for, they also have a larger variety of inspiration and ideas. For example, if I were to make that Pikachu again, I definitely wouldn't tackle it the same way I did on my first attempt. I would go for something smaller, squarer and simpler. So it's interesting how I'm sure that you can get better at build battle just by playing and, for light of a better term, just building what everyone else builds. <laughs> and you can just do it because I, I built this laptop before and although I did it slightly differently, I've learned from where I went wrong last time and how I could improve this time. So yeah, it's rather interesting. Now, if I'm actually fast enough, I might be able to get a Apple logo on the back of this just for the sake of a little bit of detail. So this has been a rather boring build, but you know, building a laptop is never gonna be that much fun. I can't actually think of mm, much more that I would change on a build like this, especially in a round, oh dear, 15 seconds. Uh, if I had an Apple head, I'd put it on the back there. Oh, 10 seconds. 10 seconds. I don't have enough time. I don't have enough time. Come on, four, three, two, no! <laughs> okay. As I expected, people used the L shape. However, they haven't gone for keys, but I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, he said he didn't finish. I'm gonna have to go okay. I wasn't expecting much more. Uh oh. Now that's just rude. That is just rude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to give the poop. 
yeah, real mature. He's right. It's not not okay. That's not okay, people. So let's have a look at this one. Um, question mark? Maybe I'm. I'm sorry. I. I don't quite know what that person's done. And this is the best one so far, so I'm gonna have to give it good just for the sake of being the best one so far. And they've even put Minecraft on the laptop, so that's pretty interesting. Wow, this guy has some really hot keys. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to go for okay. It's not quite as good as the last one who put in the extra mile of detail. This person has. I suppose he's made a laptop with a thing, so I'm gonna have to give it good. It's got something on the inside for the detail, and it's even got this uh, sort of leverage. Damn it, I wasn't able to finish the bottom, but at least people can maybe appreciate the space bar and all the buttons that I put in. Uh, so maybe they'll like that. And. I am not too sure. I think people got stuck on this. I'm only going to give this okay. They didn't finish, but I can see where they were going with it, and that's what's important here. And on to the next one. This is a similar design to the one we saw before, so I'm only going to give it okay. They could have put detail into the back. It's a simple L shape. I think it could have been better, but it's not bad. It's not bad. Hey, we won! Hells yeah! So, I've lost two, and... One four now, I think. Not bad, not bad at all. I think the guy that had Minecraft on his laptop probably deserved to win over me. However, I think it would have been a close call. So let's move into the next round. Whew, a whole hour of build battle. Who was it that Blimmin uh, asked me to do this fruit? fruit. So when you think of fruit, or when I think of fruit, I think of an apple. So of course, that's what I'm going to do. And as I've learned from my time playing Build Battle, which is not very long, <laughs> um, making stuff out of clay as an organic build is probably the best way to tackle Build Battle. So let's see, I've never made an apple before, so I'm going to have to try a concept, I suppose, a theory in my head. So when an idea pops into my mind when I'm playing this game, like, for example, the Pikachu, I see it in my mind's eye, and delivering it into game is the tough part, because sometimes it just doesn't quite translate, or I'm just rushing or not paying attention, like I am now. I'm not, I'm not paying enough attention to the shape, to what I really want, because apples are not as uh, wide as that. They are more circular and I'm yes watermelon is a fruit I'll just help this guy uh, if I could type yes someone's helped him yes there you go <laughs> and work my way round <laughs> I've done an upside down apple I'm actually gonna go round here try and recover a bit Damn it, I'm not doing very well on this apple. Hmm. Perhaps a watermelon would have been a better idea, but I cannot steal that person's idea now. Uh, to be honest, I would have stuck with the apple no matter what. So, let's try and create a thicker top half. That's, I feel like that's what's going to have to happen here. Uh... I've made a real pig's ear of this one. I'll be really surprised if I can bring this back. I'm trying to save a dead build. <laughs> it's like it's like dying and I'm trying to give it CPR, but it's just like, no, Grian. No. Let me go, Grian. It's over. I've created a monster. <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna, I don't know, keep spamming blocks until I think it looks acceptable. It's actually starting to take some form. Uh, gotta keep keep going. Ah, I've still got plenty of time, so I can I can probably pull this back. But maybe the CPR's working. I'm just like, you can't leave me now. I don't give up on you. Come here, Apple. Right. So I'm coming up to the top now, and. 
I still want to go a little bit higher. The CPR seems to be working on this build. It's not over. And right. So now I'm reasonably, and I s use that term very loosely, reasonably happy with how this has come out. So I'm now going to... Actually, you know what? That doesn't look half bad. Cons all things considered, that doesn't look half bad. I'm, I'm actually really happy with how this has turned out, and I can even give it a, like, shine on the side of the apple. And perhaps now I could even make a banana, or perhaps I should leave it at that. I got a minute, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it, I believe. I believe in myself. After saving that build, I believe that anything can be done. Even in a minute. Even in a minute, a banana can be made. I feel like oh, people are gonna, like, if people are gonna be so pernickety, I can tell, like, her bananas are not a fruit, technically. But it doesn't matter. It honestly does not matter. Most people have bananas as a fruit. So. Let's just pretend that it is for a minute. I could have also done a tomato, but I'm pretty sure people would have thought it was a apple and confusion would have ensued. So I'm just gonna go for some very basic stuff. And I do believe I'm done. Now the banana's not the best, but it's not bad at the same time. Um, probably going to have that bit there and then just have one of that at the bottom. I guess that counts as a banana. And we're done. That's not bad. I was just about, I was just thinking, hey, I'm never first to be judged. And this time I was. So there's my banana and apple. And being judged first has got to be horrible because people don't know what's coming up and what hideous builds are in lie ahead. So, uh, I'm gonna have to give it okay. I can see what grapes, apple, but it's kind of difficult to tell what it is. And that's, that's not bad. I'm gonna give that good. They've done a pear, they've done a banana, and a watermelon. That's pretty good. I can tell what they are. Absolutely no problem. This guy's done an apple. I feel like my apple actually beats this one. So I'm gonna give this one okay. The guy before did do a more, more of a variety, and I'm not sure why his apple is magical. But, nevertheless, and again, look at this, look at this, and you'll notice it, now that I've pointed it out to you, you'll notice people just make these, like, little faces and stuff to accompany their build, I actually quite like this, it's got grapes, orange, banana, uh, I'm only gonna have to give that okay, they've not finished a apple, but yeah, you will start to notice, now that I've pointed it out, people make these, like, little organic builds all the time, all the time, and this guy's made a watermelon, and it's not bad. It's not bad at all. I'm gonna have to give it good. They've obviously put a lot of effort in. I bet that took a long time to place all that red wool. Whew. I probably got one more round after this and we'll see how we fed. I actually really like that. <laughs> They've put a face on the apple. Um, what's he said? The crazy not normal apple. I'm gonna give them epic for creativity. Oh wait, it confirmed good. <laughs> Never mind. So, for the sake of consistency, I gave that guy good, so the guy earlier who made the pear, the banana, and the watermelon, so I have to give this one good as well. Now, it's important that you try and remain as consistent as possible. I really like the worm coming out of that, but it is a pixel art. So, and the shape is a bit funky. I'm going to give it okay, but I do want to note that I appreciate this. <laughs> Again, look, okay, here's a prime example. If you look at just this as an apple, it's pretty poor. But if you look at it with the weird Mohican guy, it's only okay. I mean, it's, it's much better. So, you get the idea. Oh, golden apple on a tree, I like it. Good stuff, friend. That's a nice, nice touch, although the apple is massive. I do appreciate that. What does this say? Or, um, orange, orange, they've tried to write orange. Yeah, I got that it was an orange, but it is rather small. And this guy has made watermelon not the best, so I'm gonna have to give it an okay. I have definitely seen better. Like that guy who made the giant one. And the winner was the golden apple. I'm not too surprised. 
I came fourth place. Now, I'm not trying to be uh, annoying or rude here, but having looked at my apple with the, the shading and everything, I don't think that I should have come all the way back at fourth. So there might have been a bit of foul play there. But having said that, I perhaps did not deserve to win overall. So now, one more build battle, I think, and that would be the entire hour, and boy does my voice hurt. My voice hurts so much. Superhero. Oh my god, I love Batman. I'm going to make a Batman logo. I hope that that counts, but... Because um, I imagine some people are going to make like a flying Superman. But I am the biggest Batman fan. Well, I will, I'm not going to say biggest because there are definitely, definitely way bigger fans than me out there. But having said that, I have a lot of Batman comics and I really love the stories. Now, I'm not actually a big fan of the Dark Knight trilogy. So if, if anyone was saying, oh, I love Batman too, and you were thinking of the Dark Knight trilogy, then um, perhaps not today for that one. And let's try and get the shape right because consistency is key here um, right so let's take a step back it's important when you're building always to take a step back to look just look how it is it's easier to make small changes all the time than it is to make big changes at the end you might that's why a lot of people like to start over and I feel like I've messed up already yes I have indeed so it is actually here where that should be and that's hold on let me let me get my act together and that's i think where that should be let's take a step back yep cool got that correct and we can continue to move on so uh, right here's where that should start but it hasn't so I've messed up somewhere so it goes up two up one up one up one and then two I guess and we continue on to the end I've wasted an awful lot of time making this symmetrical but and I feel like I've messed up I'm just trying to take a quick way back my eyes are hurting there we go um I'm gonna have to deal with that because I've only got two nearly three minutes left so I'm going to make the yellow background, as is the Batman logo, or at least the one in the Michael Keaton films. Um, it's used as the bat signal. I should have done a bat signal. Ah, oh, that would have been really inventive. So I'm just going to do the Batman logo. Now, I don't expect to win with this in this round, to be honest with you. I'm building the bat symbol out of sort of uh, respect for my love of Batman. Uh, the, the franchise and I th I'm, I'm not ashamed to admit at all that my favorite character is not Bruce Wayne although I love Bruce Wayne to absolute bits and like he's obviously Batman you can't really beat him my favorite character in the entire franchise is actually Terry McGuinness now if you don't know who Terry McGuinness is he is the Batman of the future Batman in his old age and he gets really old they don't actually specify but he's beyond being Batman, he um, becomes old and decrepit and quits being Batman because he can no longer do it. And he creates this suit, he creates a bat suit that will sort of help him in his crusade against Gotham. However, it uh, doesn't end well for him and he has to throw them he has to give up the mantle of Batman altogether. This is not centered because it is a two block center. Oh, that makes me so very sad, people. That makes me very, very sad. I have disgraced the name of the Batman. And yes, so Terry McGuinness is my favorite character. He had a show of his own once upon a time and I was absolutely devastated to see it leave. Uh, so what I'm gonna do here is something kind of cheeky is just put a block around here and just delete all of the ones on the other side and I should in theory have a complete uh, a complete nope, nope, nope I messed up that one 
a symmetrical build again. Uh, I have totally messed up. Uh, theory did not prevail today. Let's see, that looks kind of okay to me. Oh wow, I actually did it. <laughs> it's not the best and I made that really quick because I think I got a bit distracted by my love of Terry McGuinness for this. But there we go, there's a very rudimentary bat symbol. <laughs> And, um, yeah, so, like, Terry McGuinness is my absolute favourite. Okay, so here's mine, Bat Symbol. I don't expect to win at all, but I'm, I have to... Doo -doo 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 -doo. I, know, I met the voice of, um, Batman, Kevin Conroy, at a convention once. This guy made Batman as well. I'm gonna have to give it epic. Anyone that builds Batman gets an epic by me. Absolutely. <laughs> I love it, I love it. <laughs> um... Uh, what's this guy doing? I'm gonna have to soup. I'm um, not super poop. I'm gonna have to poop you because I don't know what that is. Um, yeah, so I met the voice of Batman from the animated series and I was so excited. I've never fanboyed over anyone in my life, but just meeting him after being so obsessed from my childhood with Batman the animated series, then the new adventures of Batman, I was like, <gasps> Kevin! Oh, no, Kevin! Uh, <laughs> so uh, that's actually pretty good. They've not finished, but I guess it's a disabled person. I'm gonna go okay because they really didn't finish. But yeah, I was like super excited to meet Kevin Conroy. Does Sonic count as a superhero? Um, debatable. Yeah, so I was like super excited. And I didn't know what to say, and he, I was like, can you sign? Can you sign this? And uh, I was. He gave me a print, and I was I, tre I treasure it to, to this day. This one's pretty good. So yeah, I was really, really excited to meet him, and my love for the show, the animated stuff that DC does, is just amazing. I hope that's Bizarro Superman, whoever's made this one. Now, I love DC, and I love the comic books. I'm not a big fan of the um, live-action stuff, with the exception of The Flash, and by maybe extension Gotham, but I really liked the animated stuff, and it's such a shame that they've cancelled some of the best shows in animated history. The, like, Batman Beyond and Justice League and all that kind of stuff. It's all, it's all gone, it's all had its day, but it had a wonderful run. I'm sorry I haven't been commenting, oh my god. I got started on Batman and now I can't stop. I've just been voting away without really giving any explanation. Hey, this guy won! Hey, I came second?! What? That's amazing. I only made a Batman symbol. Okay, this guy is great. Like, I love it. I love this guy. <laughs> Whew. So. That's it. I made it. I did a whole hour of build battle. Wow. I tried this once before, and people were making inappropriate builds, and it was ruined. And I was like, oh, I cannot. I cannot continue like this. But I made it. Here's an hour of build battle. To those of you that have made it all the way to the end and you are here listening to my voice after me talking about Batman for like 10 minutes, kudos to you. Well done. You've made it all the way to the end. I really hope you've enjoyed this. I tried to talk as much as possible and improve my commentary. If I learned anything from the feedback I got from my other Let's Builds and uh, not let's build, sorry, build battles and gameplay stuff is that my commentary needed a lot of work. And so I hope that this has proven that I've been practicing and whatever else. So thank you very much for watching everyone. Goodbye.